Thanks again for helping us, sweetie. We really appreciate it. Hey, no problem. When I heard you guys brought video game characters to real life, I had to see it for myself. Plus, I love that game. Uh, so I can't wait to meet some of the characters in real life. Especially that vampire. What a hot tamale. Oh, I know, right? <laughs> okay, uh, why couldn't Zark be here again? Oh, right, sorry. He's uh, on some sort of galactic peace mission or something. I, I don't know, I wasn't really paying attention. But hey, I brought Mary in. Hey, oh, what's the doll gonna do? Hey, listen, I just want to get out, okay? Look, I don't really get to do much. Whenever I try to go for a walk, people are always freaking out, going like, oh no, a doll! Or, uh, do or dogs are always trying to chew on me. I keep getting stupid people from horror movie companies wanting to make a movie based off me, but I don't want a movie based on me unless I get 100% of the royalties. But they always say, no, you can't do that. And I'm just like, well, then I'm not doing it. And can we shut up? We need to move on. Fine. Okay, so what's the plan? Okay, here's what I figured. I think the characters will be drawn to places reminiscent of their home stages. So if we find places similar to that, we might be able to find them. Well, that's easier said than done, sweetie. These guys, <laughs> a lot of them possess really dangerous abilities or weapons, and we're not video game characters, so getting hit by a raging scythe will actually slash us to pieces instead of it just... Instead of it just, I don't know, rubbing against us like all swords in video games seem to do. Eric's got a point, sweetie. What what can we do? Oh, relax. How about we go easiest to hardest, okay? Now, who is considered the worst character in the game? Let's see. That would have to be Goober. Oh, I get it. Is it because he's my main that he's the worst? Eric, I don't make the less people in the community do. Oh, those guys can shut up. Goober's a great character. He just has a high learning curve, that's all. Eric, I'm pretty sure that guy was barely finished. Oh, shut up. Now, where could we find him? Hmm, well, Goober's main characteristic is that he likes food, so maybe if we go to a place with a lot of food, we'll be able to find him. Hey, I have an idea. That Italian place is having its annual buffet day. Maybe he's going there. Yeah, let's go! Whoa, 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 whoa. Not going there. Uh, why? Uh, no, no reason. No, no reason. Uh, you guys go on without me. I I'll find another guy. Eric, is there something you're not telling us? No, 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 okay? Just, just go get him, okay? Okay. All right, everyone, let's go! A few minutes later... Oh, I'm so glad you're here. Okay, so this guy walks in, and he's like a weird slimy thing, and he walks over to the buffet, and... He's not even stopping once! I've had to refill these trays like seven times now! But he won't stop! Look! It's over there! He's eating all the clam linguine as we speak! Ugh! Who likes clam linguine? I like clam linguine! Well, I don't! Clams are disgusting! I mean, they're like eating wads of snot and... Ugh, they're like the easiest food to get food poisoning from! Marion, you're a doll! You can't even eat! How would you know this stuff? I don't know, it's just a hunch I have. Anyway, let's let's go get him before he gets to the good food, like pesto or nochi. Actually, nochi sucks. It looks like larva. Okay, how are you so opinionated on food? Shut up. Excuse me, Mr. Goober. Hmm. Uh, hey, how do you know my name? Uh, hi, Mr. Goober, sir. Uh, we're here to um offer you more food. More food? Well, this place has all you could eat food. I, it, it's the best design I think I've ever seen anywhere. I can eat as much as I want. And do you know what that's like? I feel like I've died and gone to slime man heaven. Uh, if you come with us, I'll make you a even bigger feast. Huh, a bigger feast than all you can eat pasta? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. We'll make you things like wonton soup salad with a side of spring roll eggplants. Huh. Keep going. Uh, how about chocolate covered bananas deep fried with calamari rigs? Oh, keep going. And to top it off, ice cream sundaes with, uh, fish. Oh, you got me. All right, all right, I'll come. I'll come. All right, right this way then. Oh, thank you guys so much for getting him out of here. Eh, no problem. And, uh, looks like we even saved some of the clay linguine. 
as disgusting and vile that substance is. Let's just go see what the weird guy's doing. Meanwhile, all right, look, sir, I don't know what you mean by wanting to liberate your brothers. This is a pumpkin patch. Ah, another person keeping us pumpkins down. Because that's all that you do. You think that we pumpkins are just tools for the oppressors, don't ya? Well, once I get my wish, I will make sure that us pumpkins are liberated. Dude, calm down. Why am I even talking to you? You're a bundle of hay. Hey, hey, hey. I am made of straw, not hay. There is a difference. Huh. Well, guess what? Straw is just as flammable. How about a little fire, Scarecrow? <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's Fieldwalker. Okay. Okay. How do I approach this? Hmm. Uh, wait, I got an idea. <laughs> Stop shooting flames at me. I, I burn easily. Yeah, dance, straw man, dance. <laughs> oh, come on. You don't have to make this personal. Hey, Fieldwalker. Ah, someone invokes my name. <laughs> hey, listen, can I talk to you pumpkin to pumpkin? What are you doing? It's not nice. It, he didn't know us pumpkins are secretly sapient. And in all honesty, you shouldn't punish him for it. There are bigger fish to fry, you know? In fact, I know this place where there are, like, people who are constantly mistreating pumpkins. So if you come with me, I can lead you there. Ah, finally, someone who speaks my language. All right, Mr. Strawman, you're off the hook this time. But come Halloween time, if even a single one of these pumpkins is gone, I will burn you to ashes and use you to stuff a pie. I'm watching you, boy, very closely. Later, again? All right, gang, how's our progress going? Well, I, well, we got Goober and Fieldwalker, so uh, how about next we go for something harder? Yeah, that should be fun. <laughs> to be continued.